got two in Spain last week. Casemiro, lovely ball. Fernandez is in here. Can he finish it off here? Bruno Fernandez. Big save. Big chance. Big chance. Fernandez making that run in behind. Time it just fizzed the yellow oh, wide. Took some defending Varane with a clever back header. And he's given a penalty for Fernandez's challenge. Referee Clement Turpin pointed straight to the spot. Balde hauled down in the referee's opinion. Oh, he nearly saved it to Haya. Got a big hand on it. Went in, I think, almost off the inside of the post in the end. But Barcelona lead 1 0. Penalty straight for them. It's a terrible ball. Fall into Sergi Roberto. Could make it two here. Kessie's effort was blocked. And then Kessie's challenge is going to earn a free kick. But United has got had agreed a fee for him in the summer. But he was steadfast that he wanted to stay at Barca. And a chance in for Fred. And he's equalised. Manchester United level. And a lovely source. And a big, big goal. Fred does it for Manchester United. Here. And Fernandes has won the ball too. Garnacho's got a big opportunity here. Christensen has got the block in. Fred tries his luck. And then Anthony! Played in behind, a big chance for Koundé, and De Gea has to tip it over, well nearly caught by a sucker punch there. Wide by Kessie, his Ferran Torres, the ball, opportunity, Lewandowski off the line by Varane, wow, what a save by him, to keep United in front, what drama, right at the deck. Tapped by Busquets, and the referee blows the whistle, it's a magical match. Right of the brick. Gallagher took it on, and Lewis Hall has broken forward into space here and drives it across, and Mudrik gets it all wrong. He's had real problems in front of goal for Chelsea as Mikhailo Mudrik, and that won't help. It's Ericsson who delivers. Casemiro! He scored with a header against Chelsea earlier in the season. He's on the mark against them once more now. Well, seems to be all and end all nowadays, but psychologically. Here's Jaden Sancho, and he gets away from Bruno Fernandes. Oh, that's three times Manchester United players maybe could have had better touches. I might have been a little on oh, Ericsson. Oh, two up here with Anthony. It's Martial, and again the initial touch is what lets Manchester United down. Yeah, I was looking at Anthony really close, thinking he's going to get his choice right. It's a massive opportunity. It's Fernandez. All with the cross off. Another one missed from right in front of the Manchester United goal. This time, Kai Havertz culpable. I can't believe it. I can't believe it that Chelsea have been better. This will be six minutes of added time. Enzo Fernandez, Conor Gallagher, and still they can't finish. Well, this time it wasn't the touch that let the Chelsea player down, it was the finish. It's Casemiro again. And it's Sancho. And even though it's not been the most convincing performance from Manchester United in this first half. Injury for Luke Shaw that's led to his withdrawal, but that's a huge proportion ring. One well high up the pitch by Victor Lindelof, who rolls it into the path of Sancho. Fernandez! Well, he was there for the taking, and he couldn't take it. Yeah, it was a brilliant bit of football at the end of the first half to get that second goal for United, and this is equally as good. Well again. Trying to 
free Mikhailo Mudrik and he's got there ahead of Varane. Mudrik going for goal and he's needing the reassurance of his fingertips to get there. There's no good one for the higher. Rashford. Malassia drives one in and did it cross the line. But the head from Casemiro is wide. After Eriksen felt he might have scored, but couldn't get it over the line. Chance after chance after chance. Garnacho. United getting back into their rhythm. Bruno Fernandes. Chicks for corner. Goes down. Penalty. Stuart Atwell in no doubt this time. Fernandez just put the issue beyond doubt. Manchester United will be back in European football's Premier Club competition. They lost their last one to Chelsea. Give it away to Rashford. Marcus Rashford follows it in. And Chelsea are just completely disintegrated. They've fallen apart. And Marcus Rashford pressed into service early. Now Garnacho. Oh, unlucky. Here's Felix. Felix going on and on and on and all the way. And after more than 11 hours without conceding a Premier League goal here, Manchester United have let one in. Balogun played in first time, and Christian Eriksen! Well, it's not beyond his skill to put that in the back of the net. Forced back here. And Odegaard made the challenge and they were complaining about it. Manchester United and suddenly Martinelli is in and Martinelli scores. A real breakaway for the Gunners. And he's been doing plenty of saluting. This allowed for the contact on Ericsson by Odegaard. Ericsson. A lovely That's... ball. Into Bruno Fernandes skips away from Gabriel. Good advantage played by Paul Tierney. It could lead to Anthony on his debut. He slots Manchester United into the lead. He's got a new badge to kiss here. And universal acclaim from the Manchester United squad and, of course, from the supporters. Saka. For the use of the hand, but uh, Saka, and that's the way it's been going for him in front of goal. They want a penalty, they want a penalty. Portin is not giving it to them. This allowed goal Get through. There might be a chance here for Saka. There is a chance, and Arsenal are level. And you can't say it hasn't been coming. Ericsson. Fernandez for Rashford, right through the middle of Arsenal, go Manchester United, and Marcus Rashford restores the lead. He probably went through to about 2006 where he became absolutely unbelievable. They put pressure on here, and Arsenal very close to being in further trouble. A little bit more of a freedom about Arsenal in this game. Or freedom here belongs to Christian Eriksen. Rashford's up with him. Eriksen looks for Rashford. <laughs> not gone up. Rashford thinks he scored a second. Manchester United think they are 3-1. And game wrapped up. Placing on here to Ericsson, now Bruno Fernandes promising for Manchester United, but he tracks the shot wide. It was there to be hit for Bruno Fernandes. Manchester City causing their own problems. Yeah, but it was his best option. It's a poor ball from Bernardo Silva. He's played it without looking. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. 
work in there by Malassia, but it might prevent the first opportunity for Haaland. That's a really good block. Fred and Casemiro were both throwing themselves at the ball. A double Brazilian block for Manchester United in the yeah. first little sniff there for Haaland. Really was, yeah. And gets the ball away. Here's De Bruyne. Samira able to win it back again. Rashford is on the move. Edison's committed himself. Rashford's around him. Defenders back though. Rashford. And the clearance made by Kanji. Sold himself there, the goalkeeper. Here's Juan Bissaka. Casimiro. Martial was challenging, but Kanji was there again. Edison had got himself in a very tricky situation. Rashford to Fred. Here's Ericsson. Now there's an opportunity for Ericsson to play Rashford in. Marcus Rashford running through, Everson out with an excellent save, this time against his timing, absolutely perfect the Manchester City goalkeeper. And all the chances are coming down that side. So Walker, tries a shot, and a really good shot too, whistles past the post. Doesn't score too many Kyle Walker, but when he does, they tend to be similar to that. Yeah, he's always been. Oh, that's a nice touch back to him though by Mares. De Bruyne on the move, three in the box for Manchester City, he's gone towards the far side where it was headed on by Bernardo Silva, still not fully clear but Casemiro is going to deal with the danger. Mares is a growing influence down this side for Manchester City, Kevin De Bruyne gets away from Casemiro, stands it up and there's the impact off the bench, it's Jack Grealish in the Manchester derby. It's only the second time he scored this season for Manchester City, but on Derby Day, it's a vital goal for the team in blue. Well, it's been coming. Might be Saka to Casemiro. Marcus Rashford is offside. Rashford's going to leave it. Bruno Fernandes! Now the flag goes up. Well, I don't think there's any doubt that Rashford was offside, but he didn't touch the ball. Bruno Fernandes finished it, and now the debate can rage. Well, Fernandes is onside, as this ball comes down. It's a goal! Manchester United are level. Old Trafford explodes, and Bruno Fernandes has the equal Straight at the Kanji. Oh, that's your ball! 2-1! Marcus Rashford! Cancelo, Rodri, De Bruyne, Haaland missed his kick, Casemiro was behind him, he wants a penalty and they are going to check it too, big moment this, full time whistle, Manchester before the game to the team, we look like a team now. Already know the consequences, already know where this road leads. In my head, no, you're not perfect But like a drug, there's no relief